Hello, today is Sunday, February 2nd, and I'm heading to Seattle, Washington, on 84th Interstate Road Freeway. So this is the Aegon State. You see how pretty much the nature of Oregon look like. Lots of snow, trees, it's very beautiful. You see that fog in front of me? It's periodically happen when you travel in this state. So we hear this a lot of elevation up and down, mountains up and down. And this weather condition exists in this state. I would love to, to take snowmobile and surf those mountains on snowmobile instead of sitting sit and driving the truck. See how beautiful that is? I love it. So now this is the fog. A lot of lots accumulation of fog. See pretty much you cannot see so far, but I hope so. It's not gonna last too long. When you're traveling in Oregon or Washington. The truck speed limit is about 55 miles per hour, but basically everybody do 58, 57 miles per hour. Oh my god. See those cars? They traveling with the high beams on to improve the vision I also did that uh, also wh what I love about this state like uh, Oregon and Washington uh, it's not getting it's not it's not bored bored compares to other states without the mountains so over here the nature and you can see and you stay stay alert every time not getting bored bored so now I'm gonna approach the way station my GPS just told me that Okay, drive slow safely. I believe this is the... Oh my god, you see? I cannot see. Maybe 700 feet, one mile, no more. I hope this is not gonna last too long. That was Roman Sherbach. Dry safely. Thanks for watching. Bye bye. This is what the truck drivers user, uh, user, usually experience <laughs> when they travel in, in Oregon. See? Completely no visibility. And there was a truck. And on opposite side, burn out almost. So I cannot see anything. <laughs> and I'm driving 45 miles per hour. And I think the truck over here, he just passed by. And over here, the 
big downhill, steep downhill, great. And I don't know, we'll see. I put the ninth gear and set up my downgrade speed on 45, no more than 45 miles per hour. And yeah, the track over here. So we are together. So it's about the 400 feet, maybe less. Oh my god, I don't like this. What could be worse than fog, low visibility, and downgrade? Ahead. I know what could be worse. Could be the snow over here and ice. <laughs> I hope it's not gonna happen to me. It's now about the oh the, the truck passing me in the, in the left. You see. I don't know who's these guys. They've been dealing with this weather all their all their lives. I think. Oh my goodness! And I turn turn on the caution lights. Basically they use for the oversized loads, but now I'm just to improve my visibility for others. It's better than nothing. I don't know guys, if you see anything, I, I cannot, I don't know if they come, uh, the camera shows how they in the real life my conditions looks like and also over here the elevation you see 2575 feet and it's going down For these situations, you have to choose your gear before you and maintain uh, and maintain your speed before you on the hill. See the run runaway round track. So in this case, you will not have any problem. So I'm just. on the engine brake so for me it's pretty easy I'm just I'm just the I'm just I, I'm just adjust the speed by this pad over here plus and minus that's all what I'm doing and just I'm um, manage the the wheel and that's all that's all we've done it so over here you see the weather nothing and now the elevation is about 1600 feet but before it was 
400. Everything went better than expected. Drive safely. Thanks for watching.